a stick shift than you are with a knife. Yeah, yeah. Oh, great. Smells like he's got a fuel leak. I love engine fires. Sorry, sir. Only police vehicles be on this point. I'm just your best jump and check it out. Huh? What's this about? Undercover agricultural sting operation. What's in the back? Fertilizer. All right, move along. Hope you really get your man. <laughs> Stop moving. Problem with your truck? Yeah, <laughs> loose holes and nothing big. I, I already pulled your bike out. It's sitting right over there. Well, nice knowing you. Gotta hit the road, you know. He did have a fuel leak, and he took my fuel line to fix it. That trucker's gonna die for what he did. The barn's locked. <laughs> he does have a lot of bad luck, you're right. Uh, you missed, uh, they have framed my gang for murder. The guy killed the old man, the owner of the uh, Corley Motors. Now they framed my gang. I have to clear my gang's name. I couldn't break that lock. I don't have anything. I don't have anything. There's a picture of Maureen and Malcolm. Looks like they're restoring an old hardtail together. No mementos. I'll have scars enough to remind yeah. me of this trip. Lots of bikes. Lots of bikes. That's the insignia of the vultures. I can't believe Mo used to be a vulture. But then again, how else could she have gotten that recoil booster? I'd like to wrap this around Rip Berger's neck. Ah, junk. And a hose I can use on my bike. I don't think Mo would mind if I borrow him. Oh. He had to do a wheeling.
probably a little bit loud. <laughs> the place looks deserted. Maybe the boss was wrong and she ain't coming here. She's coming. We just got here first. That means all we have to do is sit here and wait. Maybe I'll just take a little. This stuff reeks. It's fertilizer, what do you expect? Uh, I can be if you I probably will be streaming late. Why do you ask? It's bolted on. I wonder if the subtitles would work this time. They're usually like way behind the speech. It's bolted on. This might be good. Oh, sure. Well, yeah, I'll, I'll probably be here around then. Won't budge. Yep, it's all good. Well, that's all of them. Can't be much holding that up now. I ain't looking to buy. <laughs> Why does he have to walk all the way around? What a mess. the tour I haven't seen you since you retired from the polecats hey Ben how's my gang doing uh, that's a long story what are you doing out here well retirement's pretty boring Ben so I thought I'd come out to the old mine road and look for trouble. You're picking fights? That's what the old mine road's for, son. Any fighting tips, Torque? 
Ah, Ben, who's tougher than you? Nobody, but those rod wheelers are uglier. They're none too bright, either. I'm sure you can handle them. The vultures are quick, and they're nuts. The ones with those boosters are hard to whip. Just remember, Ben, it's not about muscle. It's about timing. What's up with those cavefish, man? Watch out, Ben. They're not out here for sport. They hijack big rigs. It's part of their religion. Don't get in their way. They're blind, cold-hearted killers. How do the cavefish ride if they're blind? Well, they're only blind because they wear those special goggles to shield their sensitive cave-dwelling eyes. Special sensors in the goggles pick up the dots in the road and other large objects and landmarks to help them navigate. <laughs> Kinda trippy, huh? Father Tort, I need your help. The gang's in jail and the law... Ben, I'm not the leader of the Polecats anymore. You are. Can't you see I'm on permanent vacation? You know any way around Cuyahoga Gorge? Around it? <laughs> it's miles and miles long, Ben. What's the matter? Don't like bridges? It blew up. Ooh, sorry I missed that. Well, you could jump it, like Ricky Myron. Cavefish got its ramp in their hideout, you know. Where is the cavefish hideout exactly? Somewhere on this road. The entrance is totally invisible unless you got those weird cavefish specks. Can't talk anymore, Ben. Eating too many bugs. Well, take it easy, Father. Give him hell, Polecat. 